Okay guys, welcome back and today we will set up um, the ailerons for a wing or also called lateral control surface. I don't know how long this video will be, probably it will be split in two or three or what else chapters, so stay tuned. Okay, first of all, we want uh, we win, we want a wing with an uh, aspect ratio of 10 but the process is the same if you want uh, two aspect five six seven what else so as we can see aspect ratio formula is span this is the span and this is the surface so we will uh, build a uh, three meters okay three meter span and this is the cord so making some calculations this is a uh, 300 multiplied by 300 and this is tre by 300 this with this this is 10 okay now for the for the dimension of your aileron you can uh, you can choose what you want but a good point a good starting point is the um, this reference which is here resume and analysis of lateral control research and uh, in the end we have a, a table with the um, most standard configuration. We will use the number two plane aileron, but you can choose. Uh, the, the the procedure is the same for uh, for uh, every every kind, depending on the on the shape of your wing, tapered or uh, elliptical or rounded. Or oh, it's it's uh, it's up to you. I mean, uh, you can choose what you want. You can play with uh, with everything. Now, as we can see, the dimension should be zero zero point twenty five the cord and uh, zero point forty half span. So let's written here. 0 0.25 cord multiplied by 0 0.25 b alpha in this case is 0 0.25 the cord is 30 centimeters and the span is 300 half this means that we have a Seven point five and per sixty. This is uh, our configuration, which means that if we have our wing, this is. Seven point five, and this is sixty centimeters. Okay, the profile for um, for uh, for this construction is the uh, most of you know it Clark. Why? But you can use uh, what you want. I choose. I prefer to use this these uh, suggestions because there is some um, documentation, some study, some research behind it. So you you don't have to perform any calculation on your plane if you want to choose one of these because just you have to read the the report and you will find all your answers. But if you find if you choose. Uh, 
another dimension I don't know if the results here and also the behavior of your airplane is um, has a, an analytical uh, background I don't know so we, we, we will go to SOLIDWORKS and start with the construction okay we have 300 3 meters of span so first of all we, do, we will left this okay here and uh, this is our profile our well-known Clark Clark and uh, the dimension I have already set up using uh, the procedure in a in episode one, we will measure the the dimension, and this is three hundred. One important thing is when you are sizing your wing to choose or have an idea of uh, what servo you will uh, you will use because if if you choose a uh, an a uh, very na very na na narrow wing pro profile you will not able to 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 put any kind of servo so you will be in trouble your servo will be outside of the wing and for my opinion is it is not a a good um, a good solution but you can do what you want so in this case we have 36.33 millimeters which is uh, a good uh, a good thickness and uh, I have uh, a file with uh, all servos and dimensions and as we can see there are all most of them are between uh, this is the height is eight millimeter eight uh, yeah eight millimeters and the width is twenty thirty eight but this is the most important is the height so we see that are all in uh, twenty so any kind of servo will, will fit inside the wing which is uh, for when possible is the best for me okay now um, we will erase these lines oh no sorry this is important and uh, okay as we saw we have a uh, 7.5 width and 60 centimeter on length so we will put a vertical infinite line somewhere here we will erase this and then we will put 75 okay we cancel this and uh, trim trim and erase in this this point we will um, put the the link it is not the end of the aileron but the link if we recall the um, the report it is stated that is as you can see is from the link not from the end
good so we will left open this one okay so now we need to set the the hole of the link so for this I have set up a list of materials that are selling in uh, here in Italy in Milan area so we see that for um, aluminium we have the diameter maximum of of 10 so I think that 5 millimeters of diameter will be good because like these are um, pipes no in fact so 5 millimeters we will try to draw diameter not radius okay I think this is will be very good okay where to place this connection link okay if you place it um, in the half which is the most common solution it is not a good choice because when this aileron will move upwards in this direction you will need um, you will find that maybe your aileron will touch the, 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 the will be in contact with the last part of the wing so the most this is one of uh, no internal no how of you you have to try later we will see adding some uh, some motion to see if the choice is good or not but in the beginning we will put just in the middle to see the the effects okay it's uh da -da -da. Okay, the half is we will put in the half and wow, perfect center in the half. Good now, since these are not mm, plain lines but just a spline, we can uh, draw a, a circle here which and uh, this will be our aileron part okay and then we will set a vertical line for infinite length and we will Uh, uh, um, let me see, let me see. Okay, here. Yeah. Let one, uh, if I can give you a, a hint try to use only a uh, full round uh, measure not um, measure with a lot of, of figures because when you will uh, build your wing you will find um, some trouble trying to, to to cut the wood and or the metal what you want so if you have uh, let's say point uh, 53 54 it's very difficult the only dimension you have to to respect is that the, the wing the cord of the wing the other and also and of course what you can find on your, your stores remember that this is a build 
a building process, not just a design. So you have to to see what you can buy in your uh, near in your house. Okay. Then we will set set up a uh, one profile with all the information we need. Later you will see the the advantage of of this. Then uh, okay. Now this is a plane wing, so we have to reinforce. Let's say that um, we will put a carbon fiber uh, tube as a spar with with a uh, ten um, ten millimeters of uh, one centimeter of diameter. With, but I think is not enough for a let's say twenty. 20 millimeters is a uh, yeah it's a good it's a good point so radius is 10 the position I don't know you can choose what you want mm, let's put in here just in the middle We check the dimension and okay. Then we will add uh, some more little elements with five. Five. Then if you will you want remember that you have to 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 design the uh, the house of your servo so we saw that the maximum uh, dimension of a servo is 20 centimeter um, 20 millimeter in high and here on length or thickness you don't have some uh, uh, any kind of restrictions so if we put oh this is 2018 mm -hmm. no sorry this line is remember it's just one not uh, not all sparse so we will erase we make some make some clean uh, mm, 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 mm. this this 22 you have to take in account also that you don't uh, don't try to remove a lot of material up on this part and on the other otherwise your, this free will be very weak so consider that the the forces during um, during the flight are not not so low this is you can choose balls out what else but any kind, anyway uh, after this this house Mm, we saw that uh, mm, 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 no we will do another thing we will set the other wings and then Ok, 
type we will correct it to 35 then 45 41 Mm. Okay, it's okay that. Sorry, one moment. Oh, I'm back, sorry. Uh, let's see. 90 millimeter just for one reason. No. Here is this is to sorry. I told you that I don't know how much this will take, but let's wait. How much time? Okay. And we will set up a hole a hole. Yes, here. Um, aluminium four. So four. Yeah, I think is five. Yeah, diameter five. Hmm. Hmm. I, I had to remove some relation otherwise and this is 12 we put that 6 